In this Hunt Showdown guide, I'm going to show you all you need to know how to get the As the Crown Flies event points as fast as possible. Dear comrades, Ivan German is back, glad to have you here and right now we have the As the Crown Flies event in Hunt Showdown. So you have roughly 14 days left to collect 2000 points and it's very easy and I'm going to show you what you have to do to get the event points and the event reward as quickly as possible so maybe you are new to this channel we are from inside fps and we are here to improve your fps experience so don't forget to like this video and let's start with this hunt showdown guide so to get points as fast as possible you have the following methods so you get one point for every small bird model which you have destroyed and another one point for every group of crows you have killed. So starting right here, you can kill the crows with fire bombs or lanterns, but a very effective way to get points very easy is the poison crossbow. This small AOE effect is enough to kill all of them. Let's talk about the bird models. If you get some mediocre or bigger compounds, you can find a lot of the smaller birds hanging on the walls or laying on the ground. Check if the property has been looted and if not, go for it. You can find the small and big bird models almost everywhere, but as I said, check the buildings and if you see some bigger bird models far away, of course you can shoot it. And don't forget guys, the big bird model will give you two points. And on top of that, you get another two points for every event themed clue, three points for every boss kill and six points for the new boss, Scrap Beak. So let's talk about the gameplay. You can fully admit to the event and maximize your points or you can improve your income of event points. If you want to go all in, you should avoid fights and switch your loadouts if necessary. Because of the effectiveness of the poison hand crossbow, you should pick that one up and combine it with a good fire rate, accuracy and a suppressor. For that I would recommend the silence windfield. As an addition, I would pick up some sticky bombs and some fire bombs. With the sticky and fire bombs, you can get boss kills quite quickly and you don't have to waste much time. Furthermore, you don't have to banish the boss if you killed it. This will also save you some time. Get some hints, kill the boss and continue with the second boss if you have one on the map. As a reminder, the new boss Scrap Beak will give you 6 points and every other 3. If you are interested in a Scrap Beak guide, just let me know. So do you need Reliquary to get the event done? And the answer is quite simple, no, absolutely not. I started with the event 3 days ago and I got about 1000 points. During the first day I was a bit lost due to the fact that I came back to Hunt Showdown after a while ago. You have still 14 days left to get the event rewards and you can do this very easily if you use my tips. So what do you think about my first Hunt Showdown video and what do you think about the current event? Write it in the comments below and if you like what you see, don't forget to like this video because maybe you are new to this channel we germans want to win at least something and if it's your like for this video i would really appreciate it and this shows me that you like hunt showdown videos and i'm keep going so let's jump to the next video